villages, the one place on earth where you can wake up to chirping birds. Ah, well, looks like we are not so right about villages being a calm, placid place. From encountering a ravenous leopard in your house to waking up to a snake in your pants, or even fighting a python to save your life, here are the most thrilling instances where villagers were frightened to the core because of what they saw. Snake Vomits Out Lizard in November 2017, one Thai family experienced a creepy encounter with a snake that turned outright horrible when it began to vomit. The family was understandably terrified when they spotted the snake, but something about the slithery creature seemed off. Instead of its usual S-shaped form, the snake had an unusually large bump in the middle, like it had swallowed something. To their horror, the snake began to spew out its gut and slowly unfolded a monitor lizard that it had tried to eat. But the horrible part is, the lizard was still whole. Ew! Waking up rattlesnake. We've seen one man wake up to a snake, but flip the tables and here a snake wakes up to a man. The poor diamond rattlesnake was having a nap. When this man began filming it, he got closer and closer until each and every scale on the snake was visible. And out of nowhere, tail out! The snake hisses and raises its <laughs> coils, playing a fine tune, warning the man to stay away. Boy, I would have fainted then and there. Here we have yet another daring person. The cameraman encountered a wild rattlesnake and decided to play with it. And just as he got too close, the rattlesnake uncoiled and, in a matter of seconds, had its fight pose activated. Despite this, the man decided to follow the rattlesnake. This was a stupid move, honestly, because the rattlesnake was tired by then and decided to pounce on him. He was lucky the snake caught the camera instead, otherwise he'd be toast. Strange Bird Five years ago in Uttar Pradesh, a group of Indian people was mesmerized when a massive bird-like creature swooped in their yard. With dangerous talons, a dual-colored beak and beady eyes, this furry bird looked like a cross between an eagle and a vulture. Surprisingly, despite never having seen this bird before, the Indians were convinced it was sacred. This was because the creature closely resembled Jatu from Ramania a Hindu demigod that holds a high status. But what is this creature? This is the Indian or the Himalayan vulture. And although it frequently visits the Indian skies, it's not well known because it's an endangered species. Luckily, India is working to conserve the Indian vulture. And these men did the same by calling the Indian Forest Department, which transported it back to safety. Courts in Kolathi Village, SA. Weird and unseen creatures aren't the only thing found in villages. Some unearth literal gems from their very core. In June 2021, Kolathi Village in KwaZulu Natal, South Africa attracted thousands of visitors because it was filled with quartz. Initially, the people thought they'd struck diamond, but a quick analysis proved it was just quartz. Now, you may think this isn't as big of a find, and compared to diamonds, it really isn't. But for the villagers in South Africa, even quartz is equal to gold. Although selling quartz won't get them too much, it will be enough to fend off hunger in a poverty-stricken village. Moving Sticks Finding quartz isn't unusual, because at least you can guess what they are. But this weird sight was recently captured and as everyone stumped what looks like thousands of tiny sticks, this weird mass becomes creepier because it moves as if alive. And it is! From each of these tiny sticks emerges a worm-like creature. But the creature is so strange, it freaks out everyone. So what is this? Some say these are mason sandworms, while others believe these creatures are a type of tube worm. But we don't know for sure. What do you think? Dog stuck with leopard. Meanwhile, this dog in India experienced the worst night of its life 
after being trapped with a leopard. This clip has a serious jump scare warning, so be prepared. The poor dog got stuck with a leopard overnight in a public toilet, and no one knows how the duo got in. But the rescue attempts went on for hours, because extracting the dog alone could be dangerous for all of them. Eventually, officials brought a massive trap and opened the door slightly to coax the leopard out. And in a fit of anger, the big cat pounced in. The poor doggo was finally let out and comforted to relieve its PTSD. Rescue Ape The western hula gibbon ape is only found in the Indio subcontinent and is one of the rarest apes in the world. They're already endangered, and one ape, Kalia, lost her family to poachers. But when she approached a villager, Ninga, she was adopted as her own. Of course, Kalia didn't immediately warm up to him, but as the days went by, they slowly developed a bond. Kalia then spent her days frolicking in the forest, swinging from tree to tree, and enjoying the variety of fruits set out for her by Ninga. Unfortunately, Kalia passed away in 2016 after being attacked by a man. And although that was a tragic end, it's heartwarming to realize she'd spent her last days in a loving home. Bear High on Honey Bears are dangerous, but they're also extremely adorable, especially when they're looking for honey, be it Winnie the Pooh or these ones. Bears can't resist the oh-so-sweet goodness of honey. But not many bears know one type of honey is so good, it can literally drive them mad. Yep, mad honey can give serious hallucinations or put you in a good slumber. This Turkish bear got high on mad honey and spent a while trying to remember what happened. Onlookers were amused when they came across the Pooh Bear and roared with laughter when it began to move, confused out of its mind. <laughs> Don't worry though, the bear is okay, and was shifted into the wild after the effects wore off. I wonder what he saw though. Drunk, tired man sleeping on horse. Well, we can laugh at bears for not knowing better, but people know what could happen if they drink too much. And that's exactly why this sight is hilarious. A man was spotted on a horse. Nothing unusual, right? But the people who found the man were a bit concerned at first. It looked like the man had fainted. But after getting a bit closer, they could hear his snores as he slept after a tiring day. The man might also have been drunk, which gives us a lot to think about. Well, at least he wasn't encountered by a cop. Otherwise, he would have gotten arrested for riding under influence. Python strangles pet cat. People will fight fire to save their pets, and this woman is living proof. In a horrifying twist, one woman's pet cat was being strangled by a python. The poor fluffy creature couldn't do anything and was forced to give up its life. People filming the scene couldn't do anything because they were terrified of being hurt in understandable fear. But suddenly, the pet owner emerged with a hard floor squeegee, and wham! She began hitting the snake. Horror soon turned into relief as the python finally got whacked enough to let go of the cat. Well, Mr. Whiskers won't be going out for a while. Eggless Birth We've all learned that snakes lay eggs, but this snake birth went viral for defying science and the laws of nature. This mother snake birthed little baby snakes that popped out right from the mother, and not the usual eggs. Now, I know it's a little freaky, but hold on! Turns out, despite popular belief, not all snakes give birth the usual way. Some species of snakes make eggs, and instead of laying them outside, they keep them within their bodies. When the time comes, the snake babies hatch from the eggs, but are still inside their mother's body. So, the baby snakes slither their way out into the real world, as you can see here. Amazing, right? Tiger Snake in Man's Pants Well, snakes may be a marvel, but they're pretty terrifying. And being in the Australian wilderness doesn't guarantee fair play when it comes to snakes. Back in 2018, this young Aussie took a break from work and woke up to a tiger snake in his pants. 
And no, this wasn't one of those, there's a squirrel in my pants moments from Phoenix and Ferb. The snake was dangerously close to the man's groin, and he was rightly scared. I can now want to go. So, uh, yeah. Wish me luck. Numb. The man managed to clamp the snake with icy grippers and waited until he was calm before pulling it out. Jesus Christ Almighty! Bulls fight in the street. Someone needs to teach these bulls about etiquette because fighting in the street is not a good look. The two bulls thrash and fight each other, stumbling into obstacles and even crashing into a fruit stall. <laughs> this happened in an Indian city, but the citizens couldn't do anything about it because they're a protected animal. So while the bulls were tossing and turning, throwing each other into stalls, Poor vendors had no choice but to run away and wait for the fight to fizzle out on its own. Thirsty Cobra I'll be honest, I find it pretty annoying when people meddle with nature just for gags. But this clip redeemed my faith in mankind. In April 2022, a man found a king cobra in a fishing net near a rice paddy field in India. Initially, the man decided to ignore it but when he realized the cobra was actually ensnared in the fishing net, he decided to call Mirza Arif, a snake rescuer. Of course, the rescue took a while. After all, Mirza was handling a cobra. But this heartwarming story doesn't end here. The man soon realized the snake must be thirsty, so he poured water into a Sprite bottle and bottle-fed it to the snake. Before we move any further, like this video, subscribe to our channel, and hit the bell icon so you can keep watching our amazing content. Rescuing an alligator from a python. Well, you'd think there's nothing more ferocious than an alligator, but this footage shows the most dangerous animals can feel threatened. Mike Kimmel was visiting the Florida Everglades when he stumbled upon a massive gator. But instead of being frightened, he moved toward the alligator. Turns out a massive python was fighting the alligator and had already coiled around the gator, slowly constricting it. But Kimmel wasn't having it. In a surprising twist, Kimmel picked up the duo in his bare hands and pried them apart. The snake is too shocked at the interference, and the gator doesn't lose a minute in running away. All I can say is, Mike Kimmel is one brave man largest croc ever. This is Chris, the massive Savannah King croc that was reportedly almost nine meters big. Christina Pawalski was an excellent crocodile hunter, but she didn't get the well-deserved fame until she came across a giant crocodile in July 1957. Christina was an excellent marksman and refused to miss aim, and then shot it. The crocodile was so big, transporting it was physically impossible. So, Christina and her husband invited photographers and journalists to take a few snaps, and then left the croc's carcass in the lake, where it decayed without ever being found. The entire ordeal was so insane, people refused to believe it was true. But after seeing photographic evidence, people actually named the croc after her. Crocodile Camouflage We've seen people hunt crocodiles, but have you ever seen them turn into one? Members of a tribe in Papua New Guinea experience a long ritual that begins their manhood. And in the final stage, these members undergo a rather painful yet important process, marking themselves as crocodiles. Rows of men gather to observe as each of the men let a skilled cutter mark their back with blades. The cuts are made in a way that resembles the skin of a crocodile. So, the men are also called the Crocodile Men of Papua New Guinea. Although highly painful, the men bear it with pride, because once they heal, they are no longer boys, but grown men, worthy of leading the tribe. Croc Pets Those men might have just looked like crocs, but tribes in Mali and Chad live with them. Sounds scary and impossible, right? Well, the Doggins in Mali and Bidadet nomads in Chad believe crocodiles are sacred, which is why they feed them daily, respect their territory, and often even raise baby crocodiles. Although they are aware crocodiles are highly dangerous, they aren't afraid. Some swim with crocodiles, 
and others have even saved a few crocodiles' lives by offering them water in times of drought. The tribesmen even believe that if any harm befalls a crocodile, one of them is also bound to be hurt or even pass away. What an amazing relationship! Thai Snake Village Alright, it seems many villages have strange traditions, and most of them involve animals that you wouldn't usually go near. In Thailand, one such village has earned the name the Snake Village, and we don't have to tell you why. The people believe snakes are important beings, so they raise them as babies and live with them until they're well into adulthood. Most villagers even let children play with the snakes because they believe there's nothing dangerous about that. Kids grow up with snakes, play with them, bathe with them, and even sleep with them. Wow, that's a village that knows no fear. Cow Belly, Tribe Snake Village, India Thailand isn't the only one that's playing with snakes, India is too. It's already well known that India has no problems with snakes. In fact, they worship them too. That's because according to Hindus, snakes are a symbol of good luck and fertility, and keeping them happy and well-fed means you're pleasing the gods. The Kabeli tribe takes it up a notch. Instead of just worshiping snakes when they come across them, the Kabeli tribe keep them as pets and even lets toddlers play with snakes like cobras. Snake Man of India Well, although Indians hold snakes in high reverence, there are some snakes that even the most devout Hindus could handle. And that's where this guy comes into play. This is Morali Husala from Uttar Pradesh, and he's known as the Snake Man of India. Husala is frequently summoned when people encounter snakes that they can't handle. Morelli Husala not only manages to lure the snakes away from citizens, but he seems to enthrall them with his personality. The snakes are rescued and spend hours with him. He even dares to sleep with hundreds of them coiling around. And when it's time to rehabilitate them back into the wild, some snakes choose to follow Husala. Hyena Men of Nigeria You'd be able to control a snake, but imagine taking one of the most cunning and dangerous animals into your humble abode. This is a mysterious group in Nigeria known for their very peculiar and daring choice of a pet, hyenas. Meet the hyena men. The hyena men live in northern Nigeria and raise baby hyenas as their own. The hyenas are kept as beloved pets, taken to family dinners, and even sleep close to their owners. The hyena men take them everywhere, including searching for food. Occasionally, at festivals, the hyenas are presented as an exciting display. Some even learn tricks to appease the crowd. And if you think there's no use, the hyena men beg to differ. The hyena's saliva, or dung, serves as an excellent remedy for injuries. Buzzcashy Thrilling, adventurous, and a little dangerous, this is Buzzcashy, a common sport played in Afghanistan and Kazakhstan. But not the way you'd think. While Buzzcashy may look like a generally exciting version of polo, a game where you basically play hockey on horse, this one has a different idea of fun. Instead of using a ball, the players use a goat's carcass. And yeah, that's as displeasing and weird as you'd think. But although this might seem unusual to us, for the players, it's all about perfectly picking up the goal and chucking it in the goal. Controversial, but quite exciting. Rocket War Well, it seems Afghanistan and Kazakhstan aren't the only countries with a rather terrifying sport. Greece has two. Only it's far more thrilling than any other game. The Greeks of Chios Island play an annual sport on Easter called the Rockatellum Polis. And yeah, it's literally a rocket war. So, how does it play out? Two teams of rival churchgoers visit churches standing on opposite hilltops. And then, the goal is simple. Fire a rocket and hit the rival's bell tower. The next morning, the two teams come together to count all the strikes. The winner is announced. But just to keep the game going, each parish declares themselves as the winner. Sounds fun, right? It is. Surprisingly, there hasn't been a single incident that'd make them stop. Maasai Warrior Runs Off a Lion 
A group of tourists visiting an African reserve was calmly watching a lion attempt to eat a cow. And out of nowhere, an angry Maasai warrior came running by. And in an extremely unexpected twist, ran toward the lion, his staff high. Shockingly, the lion ran away. And while the Maasai man grabbed his cow, the tourist called him crazy. But was it crazy or just a farmer protecting his herd? It turns out Maasai people aren't afraid of lions, mainly because they live close. It's also because one of their rituals involves hunting a lion, and Maasai would go all out to help a cow in need, because to them, cows symbolize prosperity and luck. Stealing meat from lions. Well, it's pretty daring to confront a lion and beyond imagination to steal from it. But Darabo hunters in southern Kenya do the impossible. Three of the Darabo hunters closely watch a pride of lions feasting on a wildebeest. Two of them suddenly jump from their hiding spot, startling the lions that drive away. And then the work is easy, but must be done quickly. The Darabo hunters quickly pry off a leg or any meat part that's easier to get and then return to their homes satisfied with the food and happy that they didn't have to hurt the lion. As for the king of the jungle, he begrudgingly shifts his food away from future thieves. Lion Rescued from a Well If you feel bad for the lion, perhaps you'll feel better after seeing this rescue. In 2016, an Ashtik lion in Jungda district of Gurat, India, fell into a well and was growling for help for hours until his saviors finally arrived. Ashtik lions are already endangered, and if this trapped lion passed away, it would have been devastating. But kind-hearted men soon got to the rescue, although it was one of the most daring ones. The men had no tranquilizing equipment, so they manually had to tie ropes around the lion. I still can't believe it! And then they carefully pulled up the lion, which was staring intently at its rescuers. By the time the lion was almost out, rescue services had arrived. So they helped rehabilitate the lion back into the wild. Mountain Lion Rescue Imagine having to rescue a mountain lion, not from the wild, but your house. Homeowners in the city of Boulder kept on hearing hisses and growls from their porch in late February 2022. But they couldn't figure out what was the cause. Eventually, the family dog began barking at the deck. So on November 27th, the owners finally decided to peek under the porch and found a mountain lion, apparently stuck under there. After a few frantic calls to the police and wildlife rescue, the couple was relieved to see the mountain lion pulled out after being tranquilized. And that's why you should never ignore your dog. Dog and puppies rescued from rubble. Another rescue dog, although this time a mama dog sought help from people. Animal aid rescuers were called, and they soon reached the frantic mama dog, pleading with whines to save her babies that had apparently been buried under rubble. The rescuers immediately got to work, moving the rubble with bare hands and even scraping away the dirt. But mama dog felt too restless and couldn't control herself from helping, guiding the rescuers' hands to her pups. And one by one, the rescuers got the pups out. The mother dog instantly took them under her wings, licking them, caressing them, and looked at her saviors with an expression only a mother could have. Donkey Helps Fellow Humans aren't the only ones with a kind heart. Many animals do too. This donkey tried to go over the fence, but couldn't figure out how. For a while, the two donkeys watched their friend attempt to cross, and when it couldn't, one smart donkey finally took matters into his own hands, or mouth. In a wholesome twist, the donkey pried apart one portion of the fence, dropping it on the ground. The three donkeys then happily crossed the now useless barrier. Whoever said donkeys are idiots hasn't seen this one. Croc in the Streets Three years ago, Indian city of Vadoria was literally flooded after a heavy rainfall brought sweeping currents from the Vashwamti River. But it seems the citizens had bigger problems on their end, and it was swimming in the streets. Residents became concerned after a scaly tail emerged from the water. 
Apparently not one, but many crocodiles had wandered into the city with the water flow. Most were terrified because the croc had a major advantage, water. But brave-hearted people realized the crocs were far from a threat and were in fact looking for help. People guided the crocs back to the shores with the help from the forestry department. And after a painstaking rescue, the city was drained too. Gator with Tire Rescued Imagine living with a giant rubber circle wrapped around your neck. Another gator rescue, but one that'd make you shed tears. This gator was spotted swimming in Indonesian waters with a tire on its neck. Closer inspection revealed it wasn't on purpose. The gator couldn't remove the tire and was forced to live with it for a whopping six years. This was highly dangerous, as having a tire severely restricted the gator's hunting abilities. So, in 2022, rescue officials finally decided to solve the problem. They tranquilized the gator and cut off the tire. Conservationists then released the alligator back into the wild. Gator in a Trash Can One gator wandered off into a neighborhood, and its return to the wild was unique. A brave man cornered the alligator with a massive trash can and with slow nudges tried to coax him in. When that didn't work, the gator catcher eventually pushed the gator, which crawled into the garbage bin and shut goes the lid. I can't believe this worked. This only happens in cartoons. The man then hobbled up to the grassland where he suddenly unfolds the bin and out crawls a disgruntled gator. Now, that's an impressive way to save yourself and the gator. But how did the reptile get there in the first place? Well, this happened in Florida, and I'm sure you can connect the dots there. Leopard Invades Indian Village India is a host to many wild animals, and sometimes it doesn't always work out. A leopard broke into a society in Champur, Mahastra, obviously spooking people. Citizens were unable to handle the leopard, which then entered a house and spent hours prowling until the terrified homeowners escaped and called the authorities. But even when the authorities came, catching the leopard wasn't an easy task. It leapt out of the roof and attacked a man. But don't worry, he escaped unscathed and the leopard was driven away to its home. Lion invades house. The Indian homeowners were able to get out, but imagine being cornered by a ferocious animal and having nothing but bare land outside your house. Such was the experience of Dylan, a man who was hoping to observe lions during his stay at the Bijan Nature Training Camp in a South African game reserve, but severely regretted his wish when it came true. Dylan was about to have a cup of coffee when he heard a horrifying growl and more followed. A lion had followed Dylan home and was roaring angrily from across the flimsy kitchen window. The lion was just protecting its family and left soon. But Dylan spent minutes in a scary situation that could have gone horribly wrong. Giant Python, Indonesia There's nothing more terrifying than coming across a predator that is so big you need an excavator to pick it up. Well, one excavator was working in the forest, and when it jabbed at the ground, it pulled a massive python that towered the machine even though it was hanging off of it. But this isn't the first time Indonesia has witnessed giant pythons. A group of men manually captured a giant python and managed to cage it. Were they daredevils or brave-hearted saviors? I don't know. But one thing's for certain, Thailand is off my travel list. Python in Fields, China Another colossal snake was captured in China, and its impressive length speaks for its personality. Farmers in China were terrified of the massive snake that lurked in their fields, so they decided to seek help from experienced snake handlers and rescuers. The snake had latched onto the ground, so it took a lot of pulling to get it out. At one point, it even tried to attack the men, but luckily they blocked its attempt. And then one brave fellow finally managed to grab it and became a hero. Snake, Spider, Mouse Size doesn't matter, folks, and if you need any proof, here's one. This itsy bitsy spider was spotted in its web, which was holding not tiny insects like you'd expect, but a big mouse and an even bigger snake. Now, you might be wondering, how is it possible to trap such big creatures? 
Well, this is a red-backed spider, better known by its alias, Black Widow. And this spider has a venom that can attack the brain, stopping all bodily functions. So that might explain how the snake and mouse got in her hold. But that's not all. The Black Widow's web is quite thin, but has such amazing stickiness, it holds their weight without even sagging. Monkeys and Snakes Here's a hair-raising moment when one python snatched a monkey amidst hundreds of them. The daredevil snake coiled around its meal, but the troop of monkeys began swarming it, disrupting the process. Initially, the monkeys succeeded. They continued poking the snake until it began attacking. But by then, the snake had realized it quickly needed to devour its meal before the monkeys overpowered. In a swift motion, the snake swallowed the monkey, leaving all the other monkeys looking horrified and in despair. This just shows the power of a python. Gator versus Python It's not easy winning against a snake, so call this Gator Impressive, because that's exactly what he is. The gator isn't as big yet and still has room to grow, but that didn't stop it from taking down a python that had been bothering it all day. The python tried wrapping around the alligator, hoping to squeeze it. But the gator had a specific technique for this situation, the infamous gator roll. In a swift motion, the gator had twisted the snake, which lay helpless, and the gator won the battle. Well, now for the moment you've been waiting for. This happened back in March 2014 in Mount Isa City, Australia. And with such an exhilarating encounter, it made international news and continues to thrill people almost a decade later. An Aussie croc and a python got into a thrilling battle. And while the croc heavily outpowered the python, the end is not what you'd expect. After a long tussle, the alligator scratching the python with its jaws and the python viciously hissing, the snake finally wrapped around the croc, completely subduing it until it could no longer fight. But the python wasn't satisfied here. After the croc's humiliating defeat, the python swallowed it whole, with just the tip of the croc's tail visible from the python's mouth. Now that's what I call an epic battle. Thank you very much for watching the video. Do like and share it with your friends. Subscribe to the channel and hit the bell icon to not miss any of the upcoming amazing videos. Thank you once again.